as we read Surah Fatiha Allah introduces himself as Rahman and Rahim. What does this make us think about Allah? That Allah is our master, but the most merciful and most compassionate. This immediately makes us think that we have a kind, merciful master. However, this should not mean for us to take advantage of these attributes and to indulge in sin. Because as well as Allah reminds us that he is Rahman and Rahim, he reminds of his other attributes which is ad da which means the punisher. And fear Allah. Indeed, Allah is severe in penalty. But before the punisher, he's the merciful Lord. As Allah says, whoever walks to me, I will come running to him. Therefore run to Allah and don't fear seeking forgiveness. Allah describes himself throughout the Quran. In Surah Anam chapter 6 Allah says, With him are the keys of the unseen, no one knows them except him. And he knows what is in the land and sea. Not even a leaf falls without his knowledge, nor a grain in the darkness of the earth or anything, green or dry, but is written in a perfect record. We would not be able to keep track of everything and if we were to we would have to work extremely hard, but this is extremely easy for Allah to know. Which is why Allah's name is all-knowing, all-seeing, all-hearing. Allah isn't deprived of any knowledge, Allah has knowledge of things that we cannot comprehend. He knows the exact weight of all the mountains of the world and the exact volume of all the oceans. He knows the exact number of drops of rain that fall from the sky and the exact number of leaves on all the trees in the entire world. A creator knows what its creation is made of and has knowledge about his products like a robotic engineer, knowing about how his robot will operate. Therefore we need to acknowledge that Allah is the Lord of all worlds. The Kursi and we should remember that Allah knows every little thing that is happening whether we as humans can see or cannot see. He is a punisher for those who go against Allah but also Rahman and Rahim for those who walk towards Allah. This is who Allah is.